Hello guys, welcome to the Maki Vlogs. It's me again, Chef Maki. Now, I will show you how to cook the best and very easy Singaporean chili crab. And this is one of my top favorite in Singaporean dish. Please watch this. Okay, this is what we need. And all ingredients is very easy to find to your little supermarket or local market. We need two cloves of fresh garlic I already chopped. Three pieces charlot cut into dice. 100 grams raw sugar. 5 tablespoon chili sauce. Any brand. 3 tablespoon chili sambal. Two pieces fresh tomato cut into tubes. Three fresh egg. Salt and pepper to taste. And four pieces fresh crab or one kilo. Okay, our fresh that we need to pan fry the crabs. So now we have to uh, reheat the large cooking pan and add the cooking oil. The oil must be really hot. When the oil is ready, so place the crabs into the hot oil one by one. Guys, and also remember do not stand too close while you're cooking the crabs. The crabs will tend to sputter during cooking, so the oil will flashing around. So be careful, your skin will be hurt. To all my new viewers who haven't subscribed my YouTube channel, please, please, please subscribe my YouTube channel and hit the bell to notify you to all my new videos. Thank you. And we have to flip one by one. At least it will cook nicely. It will take 3 to 5 minutes. When the crab is already cooked, so we have to transfer to the straining bowl then after that we set aside first so it's ready actually so we have to transfer first This is how easy to cook the chili crab. So everything is already transferred. So we need to set aside first. Okay, we have to move to our second step. We need to cook the sauce. When the oil is ready, we have to saute all the ingredients. So now, we have to add the charlot. I use charlot because I want more tasty to my sauce. So we have to stir this one continuously. Then we add the garlic. So we have to stir again continuously. At least the fragrance will come out. So we add the uh, fresh tomato. So we add the pepper.
salt, then we have to stir this one continuously again, then we have to add the chili sambal. The chili sambal any brand guys so you can buy anywhere so the chili sauce also any brand so everything the sambal and the chili sauce already add on so we have to stir this one continuously again so we add the sugar the raw sugar So I have two cups of water here. So we have to stir this one. At least it will combine together. Then we have to put the cover and bring it to boil. So the sauce is ready and boiling. So what we need to do, we have to put it back, the crab inside our cooking pan. So we have to stir this one continuously until the crab is coated by the sauce. And after that, we have to bring it to boil again. It will take 3 minutes to 5 minutes again, guys. So it's already boiling and 100% cooked. So we have to move to our next step again. Move on to the eggs. Use pork or you can use whisk to beat the egg for 30 to 60 seconds. Make sure the eggs are fully broken up. So the crab is still boiling we have to turn off the gas range so now we have to add the egg inside so what you need to do we have to stir this one continuously at least the egg will combine nicely to the sauce and that's why i turn off the gas range at least the egg it will not overcook Okay guys, it's, everything is ready. So let's go to my backyard and get some spring onion. I use a spring onion for my garnish. So we have to slice this one. So it's already sliced. Okay, guys, my Singaporean chili crumbs is ready. So, guys, thank you so much for watching until the end. And, guys, don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel and hit the bell to notify you to my new videos. And enjoy your lunch or your dinner. And see you soon. Thank you so much. Thank you.